Ernie Punch McLean has had more than one lucky escape in his life, and this week, another. He was rescued from the B.C. wilderness, about 80 kilometers east of Dee's Lake. He got lost hunting for gold. Chris Brown has more. Well, here we are with uh, Ernie Punch McLean. A man who already has a larger-than-life story has another fantastic one to tell. Actually, people out there, it's good to be here. Ernie McLean spent four nights lost in B.C.'s far north. He emailed us this video from Dee's Lake with the man who rescued him, Jim Reed, filming and asking the questions. When uh, Jim finally spotted me, it was God sent. Just a little week, that's all. Everything else is good. McLean was gold prospecting in an area accessible only by float plane. He got separated from his partner, slipped into a crevice, and told CBC Radio he got disoriented when he got out and walked in the wrong direction. The biggest problem I had was my legs were aching, but I drank a lot of water, good mountain water there, so that kept me going. As a legendary junior hockey coach, McLean's new Westminster Bruins made it to the Memorial Cup four times, winning twice. His reputation as a winner was surpassed only by that as a brawler. Seven of his players were charged with assault after this melee. Along the way, friends say he became enthralled with striking it rich. And my wife always calls him, says he's got gold fever. McLean spent a fortune looking for gold all over B.C., and this wasn't his only close call. He once survived a plane crash, losing an eye and breaking his jaw. No wonder friends say his wife is on an emotional roller coaster. And I know Fran is just dying for him to get home, give him a big hug. And we were talking about whether we were going to be happy or mad at him. We've decided we'll try to be happy. <laughs> McLean is thanking his rescuers, but what he won't divulge is whether he actually found his gold. Chris Brown, CBC News, Vancouver.